We've been making clothes for thousands of years. But in the last two decades, they've increasingly been designed in the world's richest countries and made in some of the poorest. Computerization and the internet have helped create a global industry, where the price of high street fashion comes down, but we hardly know anything about working conditions in the textile factories where our clothes are made. Coming up, you'll find out why these Bangladeshi workers think you should pay more for high street fashion. You'll see how consumer pressure has improved working conditions in some factories, and you'll hear why more and more people think buying fair trade products is an alternative way to make your fashion ethical. There's no denying it, we all love a bargain. And for most of us, there's no better bargain than finding that perfect piece of fashion at a giveaway price. But when it comes to textiles, globalization usually means someone somewhere else in the world is paying for the real costs of cut price clothing. It's rush hour in Dhaka, the capital of Bangladesh. Every day in this city, around 4 million people go to work in textiles factories. These workers are paid about 1 50th of their American or European counterparts. And that's the main reason nearly every major clothing retailer or brand in the world will get some of their products made here. It's also why Bangladesh has become the world's third biggest clothing manufacturer after China and Turkey. We are number three now and our target is to become number two and then number one someday because we have uh, we have a very uh, a very uh, important and major asset that is the manpower low cost manpower but with pressure from retailers to keep prices down factory owners say meeting compliance standards is pushing them to the brink and for once, unions and factory owners agree about what needs to change. The multinational company, they are the main player of this business. This multinational company, they are providing order towards the local business people, factory owners. Even they are sourcing their raw materials from other countries. They are uh, taking back these goods in other countries, they are selling their product to the consumers. And it means that they are in the key position, main player of this business. If they are the main player of this business, obviously they have the main responsibility for the betterment of the total workforce in this business. 